And tonight, the fentanyl crisis growing here in the U.S., but it's also impacting the Central Coast. We are learning more about a young girl who overdosed at Depot Park in Santa Cruz. KION's Natalie Gutierrez spoke with police, people at the park, and medical experts about what can be done. Sammy Pratty walks her dog at Depot Park every day. She was a bit alarmed to find out what Santa Cruz police say happened here last month. Deputy Chief Bush tells KION that a 12-year-old girl purchased suspected fentanyl and made her way to Depot Park with another individual and had an overdose near the bathroom area. I wouldn't think that kids you know, so young would be doing drugs. Law and fire officials responded to the scene and provided medical treatment to the young girl. She was stabilized and released to her mother. Something that Dominican Hospital medical officials are not too surprised to hear. They've seen an uptick in drug overdoses within adults and children from last year to this year. They also add that last month they've seen an uptick in fentanyl mixed with methamphetamine drug overdoses of young children. During February, we have seen a significant increase and uh, middle middle school aged children, 13 to 15 years old, coming into the emergency department who have overdosed. Because of this, they want people to know that they have resources for anyone, adults and children, who are battling with substance abuse. You can come here to the emergency department, go to our triage nurse and ask them, can I please have a, a bottle of the Narcan nasal spray? And they're going to give it to you. No questions asked. In Santa Cruz, Natalie Gutierrez, KION News Channel 46. According to the National Institute of Drug Abuse, drug overdose deaths from 2019 to 2021 killed more than 100,000 Americans last year.